Welcome to the Colorado Integrated Food Safety Center of Excellence Specimen Collection video. This video will demonstrate how to collect, package, and transport stool specimens as part of a foodborne or enteric disease outbreak in Colorado. Before sending specimens for testing, you must obtain testing approval and an outbreak code from the EPI section at the Colorado Department of Public Health and Environment. To get approval and an outbreak code, call 303-692-2700. We are working on a point source foodborne outbreak of unknown etiology. Case X provided a bulk stool specimen using the kit and instructions provided. Let's do an Amy's swab and package both specimens for transport to the CDPAG lab. First I'll put on my gloves. We'll start with an Amy's tube. First, before transferring the stool into the tube, make sure the label on the tube is filled out with the case's name, specimen type, and collection date. Fill out the CDPHE Test Requisition Form 270, and remember you will need a separate form for each specimen, even if multiple specimens came from one patient. Remove the clear cap from the top of the tube and discard. Insert the swab into the collected stool, completely coat, then insert the swab into the transport media in the tube. Close the tube tightly. Remember, the lab will not test any leaking or damaged specimens, so take extra caution that the tube is tightly closed. Wash your hands thoroughly. To package an Amy's tube, place the tube in a biohazard bag with an absorbent cloth. Close the biohazard bag securely and place the test requisition form 270 in the side pocket of the biohazard bag. Place the bag into a container, such as a box or insulated cooler, with packing material. A manifest itemizing all of the contents of the container is optional, as long as the test requisition form 270 is included with each specimen. However, a manifest does ensure that the lab received everything that was shipped. If you're shipping specimens to the CDPHE lab through the mail or package delivery service, such as FedEx, the container should then be placed in a shipping box secured with packing tape and a shipping label. The return address and biohazard sticker should be placed on the box. Label the box Diagnostic Specimen UN3373. Courier service is the preferred method of delivering specimens to the lab. For courier service, call 303-692-3086. A courier map, schedule, and brochure can be found on the website displayed below. If using a shipping company that requires a street address, send to Colorado Department of Public Health and Environment Specimen Receiving Laboratory Services Division, 8100 Lowry Boulevard, Denver, Colorado, 80230-6928. For any questions about packing or shipping specimens, call the CDPHE Lab at 303-692-3480.